Glad to have you here to participate in this ribbon cutting today, the ceremony of the Center of Innovation of Technology and Entertainment. More than four years ago, I met with Jerry on a number of occasions to discuss the concept of the Innovation Lab, his vision to mesh the academic and private sector worlds with the goal of creating new patents, new products, and new companies. Information technology and entertainment media is going to be the direction of the future that's powerful. Well, now gaming is a 30 $2 billion industry in America. The Game Innovation Lab is primarily a place for active research, especially interdisciplinary research that leads to innovation. It's an open floor plan space. It's very flexible. We actually brought in some experts on space planning um, to work with us, to do community workshops. One of the interesting things they uncovered uh, in those space planning workshops was that the poly graduate students were pining for sunlight, uh, and they really wanted windows. Uh, so you'll notice those windows over there looking out into the hallway and also looking into the courtyard. This is basically Wriggle. It's a game that we developed in order to study the sociality of movement and whether moving in certain ways during the gameplay experience makes someone feel closer to the person that they're playing with. So basically the hats make the movement yeah. more novel and it makes it more of sort of a bonding experience for people to play the game together. When people use the hats, they were typically a lot more happier. I'm working with Catherine's resident researcher and a few other students on this game called Scoop. We're trying to teach kids um, math, uh, specifically fractions, and if they're making bigger motions and bigger poses, that they'll feel less inhibited. I can honestly say that video games uh, and playing them have made my brain work differently and even arguably better. These video games need New York City. Like they really, they need that. They need a little bit more, you know, intellectualism, a little bit more pretension, a little bit more experimentation, <laughs> a little bit more innovation. Right. You know, that's what that's what games need. That's what New York City does best. It's, it, it's great when it's not just a grade, but it's actually, hmm, how many downloads do I have as, as a measure of success? And this is what is so exciting, and I wish, I wish so many others in the state could be here this morning to hear this, because it is the culture of entrepreneurship we need to create throughout the state. I know that it will be a place where American ingenuity will grow and flourish among tomorrow's technology leaders, and I commend the university for continually expanding the horizons of higher education.